Hi guys, Random here, back with a bit more World of Warships. Yes, today we're having a look at the Vampire. Yes, the Vampire. Um, HMAS Vampire. Yes, here she is, look. Um, this little destroyer is available to you at the moment for free in the combat mission. Is it a taste of blood or something? Yeah, a taste of blood. There we go. Um, now, I wasn't sure I was going to have time to complete this um, within the time, because I've had a bit of a busy weekend, so, um, yeah, it's uh, basically a mission, four missions, you uh, destroy 20 ships, then you win seven battles, uh, then you earn 25,000 XP, then you cause 750,000 HP of damage. So just play the game, basically, in anything over a tier 4 ship, in any of the game modes, and you will get your way up. First of all, you get 20 Type 5 camos, secondly, you get 20 Juliet Charlies, uh, thirdly, you get 20 Sierra Mike Plagues, and then uh, lastly, you will get 10 Damage Con 2s and 10 Smoke Gen 2s, and for completing it, you will get a tier 3 premium ship, and a six point commander. So, worth doing I would say. So get on that if you haven't already. Um, at the very least, you know, you get a free port slot. Think of it like that. <laughs> so even if you don't like the ship or you don't play destroyers, then it um, doesn't matter. Really doesn't matter. Get the ship for nothing. Sell the ship, get some in-game credit-y silvers. Um, and uh, yeah, you've got a free port slot and a six point Commonwealth captain, so why not? Um, let's take a look at her, shall we? Now, obviously, little destroyer -y thing at tier three, so the armor is laughable. Um, survivability wise, nine and a half thousand hit points, which isn't bad. Um, and the armor is three to ten millimeters thick. Frankly, I'm amazed it even keeps the water out, it's that thin. Um, artillery wise we have four single mounted or 102 millimeter lovely lovely little guns yes these things are really quite nice and if you put basic firing training on which I have you can get the reload down to four and a half seconds hmm very nice what you could also look at is maybe adrenaline rush or something like that and you can turn this thing into a machine gun yes um, it's it's quite effective for a tier 3 it really is uh, firing range of 10.1 kilometers um, I would look probably to put advanced firing training on as well and maybe get that reach out a little bit further that take it up to 12.1 I believe um, probably worth thinking about get a bit of an extra reach torpedo wise yep the guns good torpedoes not so much. Yeah, you have one triple mount um, in the centre of the ship, and uh, yeah, 62 second reload. Mm, not great. Um, torpedoes aren't bad, but they're not great. They're six kilometre range, 53 knots, which is a bit short and a bit slow, but they do have 10,000 max damage on them. So yeah, you got a potential there. 30,000 max damage, so eh, it's not terrible. Uh, AA defense, laughable, it's a destroyer, it's not very good. Uh, we have a DPS of 10 at 1.2 kilometers, we have a DPS of 4, yep, a whole 4 at 2 kilometers, and a DPS of 14 at 2.5 kilometers. So, if you've got a spot of plane over you while you're in smoke, you might eventually shoot it down, but I wouldn't rely on it for anything. Maneuverability wise, 34 knots is the uh, standard speed, 35.7 with the speed flag. And we have 520 meter turning circle and 2.5 second rudder shift. So, she's not the fastest boat, but she's nimble. Uh, yeah, she's quite easy to throw around. Uh, concealment wise, 6.3 kilometers uh, by sea, 3 by air, 2 on the proximity spotting, and 2 after firing your main guns in smoke. Because they're only 102mm guns, they don't really affect it. So it's not too terrible. 
Uh, Captain has got preventative maintenance, last stand, and BFT. Um, yeah, should we take her into a game and see how we get on? And yeah, before anybody says yes, look, pink, yes. Um, yeah, there was an unfortunate torpedo incident. Uh, I did apologise to the chap, but uh, unfortunately his repair party wasn't up, so he ended up sinking. So I went pink. Hmm. Never mind. These things happen. Um, I looked at him, he was stood still. And next time I looked over, he was, um, yeah, just going straight in front of the torpedo I'd fired. So, oops. Never mind. Not the first time, probably won't be the last either. Uh, you know, I'm generally very careful, but uh, sometimes in the heat of battle. So, here we are in the Vampire. HMAS Vampire. It's a lovely little model, this actually. Um, yeah. Very nicely done. We've got uh, the bridge there. Yeah, looks like it's probably enclosed. It is an enclosed bridge, but the uh, bit round the top there looks like tarpaulins, doesn't it? Okay, well, let's see what we can do. We do only have the vampire in the match, so everything else is a cruiser. So we should be able to be quite sneaky. Uh, 6.3 detection range. 6 kilometer tops so not ideal but uh, you know you can do the old single fire or I mean that day is a really widespread but yeah single fire is probably uh, the way to go with these and maybe don't fire them all hmm you know because you've only got the one launcher don't fire them all so Hopefully, we've got people crashing into each other by the look of things over there. Yep. Oh well, let's wish everyone luck. And yeah, the guns are pretty good. I mean, you can see there the turning speed. They're not rocket propelled, but they're they're okay. They turn okay. So let's turn in a little bit. Okay, we have. A customer over here. Yeah, remember six kilometer torpedoes, so they're not gonna come too far. So I'm gonna send a couple that way. Oh, I'm detected by it's like the vampire is over there. So I'm gonna sail directly away. Get my guns to come round. And I'm going to drop a smoke screen for my uh, my chaps over here. Uh, yep, yeah, we did get a uh, torpedo here. She's lovely. We do need to uh, bear in mind that that vampire also has torpedoes, so. Uh, Albeit that I'm not spotted, I expect there is stuff behind me which is. Oh, oh, oh! Yep, there we go, look. I just. Ah, uh, yep, there we go, right. So, thank you for being my meat shield there, sir. We had the, uh, the Novik over here which needs some attention. But yeah, these guns are lovely little guns. They really are. I know you're not going to build up millions and millions of points in the way of damage. I'm going to launch that other torpedo there. Hopefully in that Chester. Uh, this chap here in the cheeky Chikuma. Let's give him some love. In fact, why not try a little bit of AP, eh? Let's see how we get on with that. Yeah, 1100 damage, that's not bad. 
And we're bouncing. Okay. Mr. Cheeky Chikuma, we need to uh, probably go back to uh, HE for you. Let's try something into the superstructure there. Yeah, we've got a little bit of damage. 1300 damage there, that's not bad. He's down. Lovely. Right. Now we've got these chappies over here. Uh, that Kohlberg, uh, I'm going to fire at him because I think he's probably the safest one to fire at. Got an island behind him if he misses. Oh, uh, Chester over there. How are they looking? Yeah, they're looking alright, aren't they? Really? Oh, we got him with one. Okay. See if we can uh, try and avoid this island, which is creeping up on us. Yeah, but the reload on the uh, the torpedoes is very long. Yeah, you know, it does seem disproportionately long for a triple launcher. So let's see if we can get rid of this boat should be able to, I would think. One down. And one of them should do. Let's see if we can get rid of this guy. Yep, he's down. Matey boy is there, and we'll get rid of him. There we go. Okay. So that's the vampire. Yeah, the Empire. So 43,767 damage, uh, 67 target hits, 3 torp hits, 5 incapacitations, 2 sunk, 2 fires, 2 floods, 71,446 credits, 621 XP, 31 free XP. Let's have a look up here. Top of the tree, look lovely. Um, detail report. Yep, team killer status 5. Oh, I'm so naughty. Uh, and because we bumped ships with somebody there, yeah, didn't count as a uh, damage-free game, so, meh, meh. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's not bad, it isn't bad, where do we go, torpedoes, uh, 3 hits, 21,609 damage, uh, no fire or flooding damage though, that's a bit of a shame. Um, but yeah, not too terrible. What was the take home? Let's have a look. Uh, we got 68,539 credits take home and 827 commander XP. Which isn't bad. Isn't bad at all. I can live with that. So that is the HMAS Vampire. Um, she's a lovely little ship. She really is. It's very much a... Um, Gunboat, yeah, it's it's a gunboat rather than a torpedo boat. Uh, torpedoes are pretty good when you get a chance to use them, but uh, don't rely on being able to use them too often because they're not that far-reaching, and you do only have three, and they do take a long time to reload. So make sure you get the missions done. Make sure that uh, you pick this boat up for free if you can. Um, if you can't then uh, it's in the shop and I expect although it's in a bundle at the moment I expect sooner or later it will come up as a, a ship only deal um, probably for about eight quid I would think but uh, yeah keep your eye open if you uh, you don't get a chance to pick it up uh, through the game so I think that's quite enough from me for now. So um, yeah, thank you ever so much for watching guys. Don't forget the like buttons there if you enjoyed the video, give it a tickle. If you're new to the channel, the subscribe button is there. You can always uh, give that a little caress. And uh, the old bell notification icon thing next to the subscribe button. If you want to know when I put videos up, make sure you've got that, uh, that little thing ticked because that'll send you an email um, to say, 
or when the video has gone up or if you've got an app it might even notify you on a phone or a tablet or something um, so yeah make sure you've done that don't forget the old comment section there uh, if you've got any questions or requests or you know anything really you want to let me know something that's what it's there for um, yeah make sure uh, you use it don't forget RNG yep hyphen RNG hyphen that is our clan and uh, yeah we're looking for more members so if you're on the EU server why not apply to that um, yeah there's only a few of us at the moment but we're doing okay we're doing okay five and six tiers uh, have got the discount uh, got the uh, pan Asian plus three percent XP thing going on at the moment because well pan Asians and everyone likes new ship lines so I figured why not put it on the pan Asians um, but yeah Anyway, I'm just rattling on now. So, yeah, thank you ever so much for watching, guys. But for now, it's Captain Random signing off. Take care, and I'll see you again in the next one.